Christmas, I've had a camera. At first, I thought I could make movies with it. After all, great filmmakers like uh, Steven Spielberg or Steven Spielberg or who else? Steven Spielberg. <laughs> okay, that's not funny. But hey, both these filmmakers, they've begun with cheap cams, right? So first, I had to learn how to use it. It's complicated, this stuff, it's high technology, it's gotta zoom in, zoom out, it... <laughs> it's not cat piss, what the fuck? Anyway, I didn't know how to use it, so I took some time to read the instruction set very, very, very carefully. And after that, I began to film easy stuff like flowers, the sky. And with all the footage I got, I tried to make a movie, something experimental. I added a bit of music, some effects, and even a bit of song poetry, something like Smoke on the daughter and flowers in the sky. 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 But you know what? It wasn't really cinematic. So I give it up and I ask myself, what about? doing a documentary, something about animals in captivity, for example. And luckily, my cat was here. But my cat, he wasn't really into film. He didn't want to work with me. So, I took some time to think more intensively. To make a movie, I need to find an actor. I can't do it all by myself, right? But I wanted a real figure. Someone who is charismatic. Someone with a lot of energy and who, who knows a lot about acting. And as I was struggling deeper with my thoughts, it sparkled all of a sudden in my head. All this time, I had this actor right under my nose. And guess who this actor will be? Eh? Me! After all, I have a very expressive face. And I can play a lot of feelings like anger. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Pain. Oh! Oh! oh. Sadness. But since I'm not a very emotional guy, I use this acting technique from uh, this actor studio guy, Stan Lebowski, or the big Stan Lebowski, maybe. I can't remember his name. Okay, let me try again. It's salt and water. It's sting, it's sting a little bit, but... But it works! Look! I can also play a lot of different characters, like you're crazy. <laughs> I can also play the psychopaths. 
burn, 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 motherfucker, burn, burn, burn. <laughs> I can be the handsome guy and be the new Leonardo DiCaprio. <laughs> uh, oh shit! I nearly broke my jaw on this one. Okay, I had my actor, but I needed a story. I had no plot, nothing at all. I didn't know what to do. So I left the camp for a while and I took some time to relax. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, take it. Oh shit. After I cleaned the cam, I had another idea. I wasn't really ready to make a movie, okay, but I can do something different. After all, I have a great body. So why not to do a video about bodybuilding? To shoot myself during a workout, like pumping iron, and that's what I did. Cut on that. After I went to see the doctor, I took the opportunity of this recovery time to think more seriously about what I should do with my cam. And there I had a great idea to produce, wait a minute, my own, here we go, music video. <laughs> I'm a great musician after all. All I needed was a song. So I sat there to write down some lyrics, but as I was searching for words, waiting for inspiration, nothing. No inspiration at all. I was really desperate. Damn. What the hell is this toaster doing here? It really was a stressful situation. I needed a break. I thought it could help me to lay back and open my chakra in my meditation room to figure out what to do next. It's the only place where I can face my true self and be in connection with the universe. But despite the philosophical readings, the deep thoughts, the meditation, I couldn't figure out what to do with this camera I've had for Christmas. What, what the hell is this? Excuse me, may I? Thank you. No, I think I'm gonna resell it. <laughs> 